Well, I woke up this morning to come out here to another flat tire. Now, normally, I would just think it's a flat tire. But uh, this is not the case. The problem is, is that I have these mud ducks that keep coming by my house. And for some reason, they don't want me to talk. Now here he is, across the street. He's popping his head up and down like, yeah, I did it, and? And he's walking on the way. And then he's got his little lookout partner right behind him. Now, it don't take a rocket scientist to figure out what done happened here. They done come out here, and they done flattened my damn tire on my van. Now they pretending like they had nothing to do about it. Look at this guy over here. Yeah. So, in the last couple of weeks, I done had two flat tires. And I'm going to change it and go and put my spare on. And once I get my spare on, then I'm gonna go ahead and bolt my doggone uh, top cap on my tower and get ready and go play with my radio. Because I refuse to let these mud ducks that keep coming by my house, there's two of them today. I refuse to let them stop me from talking on my radio. This war is never gonna end. They can't beat you, they plug your ears, flatten your damn tires, <sighs> I don't know. Let me go ahead and get ready. Oh, in case you mud ducks are watching the video, here's the beams stretched out all across the garage. <laughs> ah, damn, I tell you what, that's the top piece right there that goes in uh, the tower. What it does, it, it just sits down in there and it locks. So see, the beam stays together. Takes me all about one minute. If I had somebody that could hold this camera, I could show you how, it, how it's done real quick, but that's okay. Ah, my air pump is now ready. So what we're going to do, we're going to try to see if the tire will hold any kind of air so I can get my jack under it to jack everything up and change the tire. Alright, hope you guys enjoyed the video of the Mud Duck Saga.